as chairman and founder, often I get asked with people what it's like to join the action team. And now with uh, a thousand coaches in 23 countries around the world, really action has grown in such a phenomenal way that's even surprised me. And I guess it shouldn't be a surprise given that the information we use to teach business owners on how to grow their business is the same that we'll teach you as a franchisee on how to grow your business. And it's also the same as what you will teach business owners uh, that you'll coach or who'll pay you to coach you, to coach them about how to grow their business. So in some ways it shouldn't surprise us, but to, to understand, I suppose, why our business has grown in such a way, um, I really want to go through the top eight reasons. In fact, maybe I'll add a ninth one to that. Top nine reasons why you should become a business coach and join the industry that is uh, business coaching. Now, let me define that industry first and foremost. And I think that the first reason you want to join is, in fact, that industry. The growth rate of the business coaching industry is quite phenomenal. Now, of course, there is life coaching and executive coaching. And I'll distinguish between the three over the rest of our time together today. But I really think it's important to understand just the power of the growth of business coaching. Firstly, look at the number of small businesses in your community and the number of them that are growing the number that start each year, the female startup businesses. There's a phenomenal number of new businesses starting every single year in your area, my area, right across the world. Entrepreneurship is at an all-time high, and that's a phenomenal thing for you in looking at business coaching. Because see, here's the challenge. Whilst they're great at whatever it is they do, and they might start a business as a hairdresser and, and be a great hairdresser, doesn't mean they know how to run a hairdressing business. And that phenomenal startup rate, as well as the number of business, business owners that already exist, is a great thing for our industry. Business coaching, I started the business coaching industry in 1993, when uh, I realized that the seminars I was delivering, I just didn't get the long-term results with people that I really wanted. And that's where coaching came about, where I could work with people long-term and get those results. As an industry, uh, as distinct from life coaching, life coaching is more about just goal setting and keeping yourself on track and holding you accountable. Executive coaching is more about leadership and just that for more major corporates. Where business coaching fits in is right in the middle there. We work with business owners one on one and not only do we do the life coaching segments of holding them accountable, not only do we do the uh, goal setting and working with their life ambitions, we also do the other end, the executive, the leadership, that sort of thing, as the company gets bigger. But it's that middle segment where most business coaches or life coaches or executive coaches fall down. The industry you're joining is such a massive growth industry, but very few of them have the systematic methodology to grow companies. What we have at Action is a 13-year tried, true, and tested. You've got to think about this. There's a thousand odd coaches before you who are out there in the marketplace testing and measuring all of the things that we use on how to grow companies. Now, with a thousand of them, not only are they using our systems, but there's a thousand business people who've come before you with a knowledge base that they've bought from their previous track record. Add your knowledge base to that. Multiply that by a thousand people. How much business experience is there within the action system on how to grow companies, how to grow people within companies? These are the phenomenal parts of the industry you're joining. I think that leads me to my second point. A lot of people look at the action opportunity and say, okay, why should I join a franchise? Why wouldn't I just go and do this myself? Well, one of the biggest challenges with our industry is exactly that. The people that print a, a business card that says business coach, they have no systematic methodology. They have no proven structured way to grow companies. And therefore, they go out there and they don't get as good a results with clients as we do. And therefore, it challenges our industry. I like to think of the, our industry as being one where we're full of professionals to do it in a professional way. Now, let's just get to the fundamentals of joining action versus doing it on your own. Number one, look at the dollars that it would cost you to just replicate the things you get as part of the action system. There's just the graphic design and web design fees alone, let alone the DVDs, uh, the CDs, all of the different systems there. What would it cost you in time and money uh, and years, I suppose, it to replicate the sales strategies that we've tested and measured over 13 years, the scripting process of how to sell this. Our 13-step sales process, which has 13 very defined steps with seven touches in the middle there, 
how would you go about recreating that and learning all of those things and what would that cost you? Just those two things alone, let alone all the marketing stuff, the how to coach business owners, how to keep them on board, all of the uh, seminars and workshops on the PowerPoint that you know have been developed over 13 years. How long and how many years and how much money would it cost for you to redevelop all of that? So that aside, because the money side of it can quite easily be proven that the action way of buying the franchise is far cheaper than developing all of that on your own. Add to that the training side of it. See, where are you going to get trained if you go and do it on your own? When you come into us, you get trained by existing business coaches, by head corporate trainers, uh, and often I'll drop into training and just say hi and chat with you for an hour on my experience over 13 years of doing this thing called coaching and how it is that you can build a great business within the action system. These things are so much more powerful. Now, I come to, uh, you know, I'll come to another point in a moment, and that's the team you join. I'll get to that at point five, but for right now, just stick with action versus doing it on your own. Understand this, that the team you join, the leadership of that team is going to be paramount to the future of your success. Myself and my corporate team, your master franchisee or the franchisor in your territory, the other coaches within your territory, the coaches that are within the country or the region that you're operating in, and the coaches globally who you'll communicate through our forums with and at our global conferences and our regional conferences. These things are vital to the future growth of you and your business. Having that team of people around you, which I'll come on more detail in a little while, but having that team of people around you is absolutely vital to your long-term success and one of the major reasons you should join a team rather than just doing that on your own. Next reason I want to focus on you becoming a business coach. And to me, it's one of the most important reasons. You get to help people. You know, if it's not in your nature to help other people grow, if you haven't, you know, you naturally find yourself coaching other people or if you naturally find yourself giving advice or you naturally find yourself wanting to help other people grow. We've got business coaches with backgrounds from teaching to nursing to army to veterinarians to uh, even tree loppers. You know, in fact, uh, a lot of our ex-clients want to become coaches, and that's where we get a lot of them from. Where they're ex-business owners who've been through our coaching program, or ex-business owners who wish they'd been through our coaching program. Mm -hmm.